Cadillac. Hits hard. Maybe. Okay. Maybe Cadillac. All right, so post game with Augustana University, Maggie Cadillac, and head coach. Brandon Stone. <laughs> okay, sorry. Uh, final score, three to uh, Augustana wins in the seventh game with the Central Two Regional and advances to Super Regional in Central Oklahoma. Coach, I'll start with you. Um, obviously, you and Oklahoma State all year outside of the one game in the tournament have been really tough. Just talk about having to come back and play that last game after losing on a walk off. You know, it, it it's just tough. And we knew going into the day that that it could be done one, it could be done two, but we knew that these games were going to be really close no matter what. And it is just literally an absolute dog fight when when we face each other because it's just two really really good teams and they have a phenomenal pitching staff. I feel really good hitters, and I, I honestly believe that that um, I honestly believe we should be playing each other because I, I feel like we should be um, in different in different regions because I really think that that these two teams are legitimate two of the best teams in the country, and so I think that's the the um, the hard part for for both Greg and I is that we we know that. And we have to keep playing each other. Um, but they are just a phenomenal squad. They've had a phenomenal year. And, um, you know, it just it happened to go our way uh, today. And it could have gone, it easily could have gone either way. Maggie, kind of the same question to you. You know, you guys were going to say all year, kind of toe to toe. Having come here to and on, obviously yesterday's win was huge to have to set up today, beating be on twice. Um, as a hitter, you and Laney all year, two of the best in the conference, two of the best in the central region. Talk about having to face when I was one and one A here and then. It's just, it's the games of a lifetime and the games of a career. They're just so exciting to play. And it's They're such a respected team, respect, respected staff, respected players, and it's fun to just play them. And it's like the team you love to hate. And it's just the fun rivalry that you just love to have and play in. And I, I like, like coach, like it sucks that we have to play each other in the regional because it'd be a lot more fun to see like what the teams can do outside of the region and see what, because we're the best teams in the country and it's just, I don't know, I'm speechless honestly. <laughs> and, and I think you really, when you said 1-1A, one one I think that's so accurate because I, I really believe, um, I, I think we have a really deep pitching staff, Yeah. but that I have not and we have literally played down south, we played a lot of the, the ranked teams down in Texas this year. I have not seen the pitching staff like Winona's anywhere else in the country. Mm -hmm. uh, I don't know if you guys have played Central Oklahoma, but obviously yes, advancing. Yeah. Talk about your last game against them, and then what did you, you know, see going to the Super Regional? <laughs> we played them in Missouri. Um, it was definitely a uh, a game that we saw on our schedule very early in the season, and we were really excited to play it because they're another team that we love to hate. And they're also very respected, and really excited to play them again because we've been kind of watching how they've been doing and hoping that we get another rematch to take them again. Yeah, they, they have a transfer uh, student who's one of their their top pitchers, um, and then they also have a freshman, and we've seen both. And they have good they have a good staff too. They can hit. Mm -hmm. there, there's no question that they can hit. Yes. Um, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, but uh, but we do know them, and we've played them uh, every year for many years. So mm -hmm. so it, it will be a, a team that that we uh, we know going into it. Yeah. So more congratulations and good luck. Thank you. Thank you.